many fish the 15th of November 2017 and I got a real quick question for the world we have an article here from Fox News Afghanistan opium production up by 87 percent they give you just a little snippet here just enough to tell you that once again for the past 15 or so years the opium production in Afghanistan has increased exponentially which beforehand, before the United States and the coalition partners occupied Afghanistan, the heroin production out of that country was quite low. I'm quite certain it was well below 10% of the world's uh, supply. It has grown to well over 90% of the world's supply since the United States and coalition partners including UN partners have occupied the country Afghanistan how is that possible ladies and gentlemen while mind you while in that same time frame this country the United States as well as a very large portion of the world have been virtually destroyed by opioids poppy derivatives, heroin. Okay? It's a good question, folks. Since the occupation of Afghanistan by the good guys, the U.S. of A. and the CIA, the opioid problem in our country has exponentially increased to the point of which it is a crisis, a major crisis killing our children destroying our families destroying our society yeah think about that one okay thanks Fox News for letting us know that the problem is still growing strong it's a fallen world folks I will never stop pointing this evil out but the fact of the matter is is it's a fallen world and you have to make a choice are you going to go along to get along while you live in this little flesh suit that withers and decays and dies or are you gonna seek peace and truth through your true Savior Jesus Christ just saying peace and grace to you any fish Finally, my brethren, be strong in the Lord and in the power of his might. Put on the whole armor of God, that ye may be able to stand against the wiles of the devil. For we wrestle not against flesh and blood, but against principalities, against powers, against the rulers of the darkness of this world, against spiritual wickedness in high places. Wherefore, take unto you the whole armor of God, 